Hey guys, welcome you all in a new video and this video is totally dedicated for those customers who's using Samsung Android smartphone of any series like A series, M series, F series, any series if you're using Samsung Android smartphone and your phone is locked due to forgotten pin pattern and password lock. So firstly, you will have to hard reset your smartphone then after uh, hard reset, I mean to say factory data reset, when you will switch on your phone, you will get a such type of page that is welcome page you can see here. here you will get a three option the first one will be show here language and the second is start and the third one is emergency call okay so let's check here what happens when when i will go with this start option okay so you can see here uh, my phone's battery is charged 94 percent so before starting this method charge your phone at least 30 percent otherwise in this method if you have if you're using your if you're using this method uh, less than 30% battery charge then you may lose your smartphones all the data because this method is also known as data saving method okay i mean to say in this method you're not going to losing of your smartphone data okay so let's check so what happened when i will go with this start option check all these options and go to the agree here go to the more and the agree Ha, huh. one more thing I would like to tell you my friend, you will have to connect your Wi-Fi here. Without uh, connecting internet, you can't access this method. So I will uh, will suggest you uh, a very important thing is that you will have to connect your phone to the Wi-Fi network. After that, you will have to go to the next option. So you can see here, it's asking here my phone's pattern lock. So if you have applied uh, pin lock or password lock, that will ask on this page. Okay, so my phone was locked due to forget pattern lock. So you can see here, it's asking here pattern lock here. But you can see here, there is an another option is showing here, use my Google attack account instead. Simply, I will go with this option. And when I go with this option, let's check what happened now you can see here it's asking here my gmail id or phone number with the help of password i can bypass this page but if you have if you uh, if you don't have remember your gmail id and phone number and password then how you, you uh, how will you bypass this page i will uh, give you some tips and tricks by which you can bypass this page but if you have remember your gmail id and uh, phone number and the password you can go through with this page or uh, you can simply access your smartphone without losing any data but if you don't have remember your gmail and uh, gmail id and password then you will have to be with us in this video till the end i will show you how you can get an skip option on this page i mean to say how you can bypass this frp here okay so after that simply you will have to go to the back option here again you will have to go to the back and you will have to reach to the start page okay now here you can see here the language option is showing here you will have to firstly change the language here you will have to go to the english uk and go to the ok you will get an emergency call option here simply you will have to click on this and you will have to dial star has zero star and has when you will dial this ussd code uh, a new page will appear here you can see here here you will get a lots of option here but you will have to go to the option of sensor you can see here sensor option is showing here simply you will have to click on this when you will click on this sensor option uh, you will get a uh, synchronizing uh, page here so you will have to wait on this page for five second and when the five second complete simply you will have to go to the back page okay now the second option is showing here you will get an option of version simply you will have to click on this version and when you will click on this version you will get your phones all the version will display on your phone okay so here you will have to wait again for five second minimum maximum is no limit you will have to minimum wait here five second and again you will have to go to the back and again you will have to go to the back option and go to the start page here now after that you will have to start this page you will have to check all these options and go to the agree here again you will have to go to the agree now after this you will have to switch on your phone's talk back mode to open your setting here okay so so switch on your talk back mode simply you will have to press the volume button and volume up button and the power button at the same time for five seconds you will have to click on this use Again, you will have to press the volume up button and the power button at the same time. Release. Now here you will have to draw a opposite L. 
you will get an option of while using app simply you will have to click on this while using app double tap you will get a pop-up of using voice command simply you will have to double tap on this option open google assistant open setting now when your phone's uh, display will show your phone setting option you will have to switch off your talkback option and for this you will have to repeat the process press the volume up button and the power button at the same time for five seconds now you will have to make some changes in settings after that you will get a skip option on the on the gmail id page okay so firstly you will have to go to the option of lock screen okay here you will have to slide to the down here you will get a two option the first option is showing here face recognition and the second option is showing here fingerprint option okay simply you will have to click on this face recognition option and you will get a pop-up of continue simply you will have to click on this continue option five time one two three four and five now the process has been done after that you will have to go to the back option here you will get an option of clock style okay here you don't have to do anything simply you will have to go to the back back option now you will get an uh, screen lock type but it won't open here don't worry at all simply you will have to go to the back option okay go to the back now here you will get an option of advanced feature here okay simply you will have to go to the option of side key option and uh, you will have to switch off this go to the back option you will get an option of game launcher simply you will have to switch off this you will have to go to the back option now here now you will get an option of general management simply you will have to go to this option and you will have to go to the option of physical keyboard and you will get an option of keyboard shortcut go to the back option you will get an option of reset simply you will have to reset this and go to the back okay now after this you will get an option of accessibility simply you will have to click on this now here you will get an option of talkback simply you will have to click on this go to the back again here you will have to go to the back option now here all the setup has been done okay now after this simply you will have to go to the back option close now after that you will have to reach to the again start but uh, starting pace here okay now after that you will have to go to the start option check all these options go to the agree more agree here now here you're getting an add network option simply you will have to click on this add network option okay now here you will have to type something that is frp and the second would be b y p a double s and star has and you will have to click on this save okay now after this again you will have to click on this here you will get an option of setting simply you will have to click on this and you will have to go to the down you will have to reset to default setting click on this reset keyboard setting reset here erase personalized uh prediction erase here go to the back option now here you will have to go to the language and type you will have to manage go to the manage input language and you will have to select here english uk english us and english india okay you will have to select all these three languages and go to the back option okay now after this again you will have to go to the back here you will get an option of text shortcut simply you will have to open this click on this plus 
add option and here you will have to type frp and the second would be byp double s okay and you will have to add here go to the back option again go to the back option again you will have to go to the back now your all the setup has been done now after that simply you will have to go to the next option what happens let's check here now just click on don't copy option now my friend you can see here you are getting here a skip option so with the help of some tips and tricks and some changes with your smartphone you can see here you're getting here a skip option i mean to say if you don't have remember your email id and phone number so you can skip this bypass okay you can skip this uh, gmail id and uh, phone number credential okay so you can get here a uh, skip option so if you also get this skip option simply click on this skip go to the skip option go to the more accept here it will uh, ask you to use new pin pattern and password lock so if you want to use new pin pattern and password lock you can use here but right now i will skip this page here but one more thing like i would like to tell you my friend uh, if your phone is unlocked with the help of this method then you should uh, use new pin pattern and password within one hour otherwise your phones will be again locked with the previous uh, pin pad or password lock and you will have to try this method again so kindly requested you if a phone is unlocked within one hour use your new pin pattern and password lock okay go to the next option skip this page skip here now you will get a pop-up of your set your all setup is finished uh, and you will have to simply click on this finish option go to the agree select your language you can skip your language option but i will suggest you select a single language here go to the next select your gender here select your age criteria finish okay now you can see here my friend my samsung android smartphone has been completely unlocked you can see here and the main thing is that you uh, main thing is that you can see here my phones all the application which were in my smartphone that like that netflix facebook baizu's all the application which were in my smartphone as it is showing in my smartphone so this is very beneficial method for those customers who don't want to lose their android smartphone data so use this method and if your samsung android smartphone is unlocked with the help of this video then do the like this video and if your smartphone could not unlock with the help of this video then make us comment which uh, samsung android uh, version is using uh, using your version number and what's the model of your samsung android smartphone our team will uh, quick response on your comment and with the help of our team i will uh, make a new video on the uh, on the model especially a special model okay so thank you so much see you in the next videos